good morning everybody hiya welcome to uh, the Yorkshire motorhome as uh, not so much motorhome adventures unfortunately um, first of all I hope you're all keeping well yeah definitely um, and safe under these uh, circumstances we find ourselves in at the moment um, and how much we all want to get out there in our motorhomes and caravans but we must adhere to the government uh, instructions, rules, um, and stay inside as much as we can. So, the sooner we do that, the more of us stay in, um, the sooner we can get out in our motorhomes. Um, so, that's the way we're thinking about it. Yeah, it is. Um, sticking to the rules um, and uh, staying in. So, um, just a couple of things, a couple of updates. Um, those of you who saw our, our vlog last week, um, so we were saying that we were going to try and get out on a, a weekly basis day trip. Um, obviously now things have changed. I thought they would do at the time, uh, but I was hoping that we could have got out and just uh, taken the motor on for a, a spin. Uh, but um, now we can't um, and we won't um so that that's put an end to that um another thing um the motorhome was due to go in for um a service and mot and habitation test um next week down at brown hills in newark um so i got a message from them yesterday saying that they're closing um which is doing the right thing and all of that's been cancelled so i did manage to speak to him yesterday and uh just ask him uh my my mot will run out while this uh covid19 pandemic is uh going on um how do i stand uh getting the motor on down <clears throat> to newark um she went away and asked a, a te you know a technician um and come by and says as long as you come directly to us uh, and if you do get stopped, if you explain that, um, and then uh, you should be okay. Um, so um, I'm taking that advice at the moment, but I'm also going to check the government website um, and see what they have to say, uh, because that's, as you can imagine, is constantly changing. Um, but as far as I know, I should be able to, um, and, and this goes for everybody, I suppose, because other people have MOTs running out and vehicles need servicing. Um, and I'm sure there'll be some sort of uh, leeway uh, for that. Yeah, so um, also um, just going to go up onto the compound a little bit later on where the motorhome is uh, stored. Um, just get out um, all the documents uh, uh, from one of the cupboards up there because I need to uh, get the uh, um, the logbook because um, the tax is due also at the end of this month so I want to sawn the motor on. There's no point paying for uh, road tax when you're not going to be using it so I'm going to sawn that uh, uh, today uh, for the foreseeable future. Um, and just have a little check around. I mean, fortunately, we're coming into the good weather now. Um, I rang Auto Trail um, yesterday also just to take some advice on what to do about the batteries. Um, they checked up on my vehicle and um, noted that it's got a, um, um, a solar panel on the roof, and it's as long as everything's switched off, um, the solar panel will work out um, which battery, i.e. the leisure battery or the vehicle battery needs a little top up and it'll switch between the two. So um, hopefully that'll do its job there. Um, might do if I can just have a quick check at the solar panel, make sure it's clean so it's getting as much sunshine um, as, it's, as it possibly can. Um, so, um, and like I say, we're just fortunate that um, we've got some good weather. Um, nice for going out for a walk and uh, getting the odd job done in the garden, which is, yeah. uh, Tracy, you'll tell them now what uh, what we've been doing. Yeah, well, we've been um, keeping ourselves occupied. We have. Um, 
yesterday I tidied all the garden. Doesn't take a lot because we've only a small garden, but it looks much better and I felt better for being outside in the sunshine. Um, we've been walking Melly separately so that we can give her two good walks a day. Um, we're, again, we're fortunate. We live very near to fields and moorland, so you can keep you a good distance from people um, whilst you're walking. Um, and it means that we're getting some exercise. There's a local country park, which we can walk to. It's about a mile and a half away, and there's lots of ground there. However, the last time we went, there were so many people there that I don't think it's a good idea to really go there, is I it? Think, I think they've closed it anyway. Have they closed it yeah. now? Yeah. I know the they local were closing, council has closed They were closing it the playground and, and yeah. things, weren't they, and the visitor centre, but... Yeah, they may well have closed yeah. it down now. Um, so that's one thing we've been doing. If you could possibly see us in the lounge, um, well, I've got my exercise clothing on now. We've just done PE with Joe. We've done Joe Wicks. Um, we did it yesterday and today, didn't we? Um, I think that's more likely to kill us than coronavirus. <laughs> um, but we've enjoyed doing it. We need to keep fit. We need to keep active. The, the fitter we are the, the and keeping away from other people is the best way of protecting ourselves and our, I mean we're missing our families dreadfully because we see them all on a very regular basis but you know we can face time and it's not going to be forever um yesterday I thought I'll do some baking I like to bake but unfortunately I hadn't got all the ingredients I needed for the things I wanted to make. And it makes you realise that normally if I'd have thought, oh, I'll bake today, I'd just nip down to the local shop and get the few bits I wanted and come back. Well, you can't really do... Well, you, you could do that, but I'm not going to do that. We, we've made the decision that we'll shop once a week um, and we'll just manage with what we've got, didn't we? Yeah. Uh, not... We've not over shopped, so we've enough food to last us till the weekend. So yeah. we'll just yeah. manage. So I can't do my baking this week, but I might mm. do it next week so I can I can show you a cake or two maybe next yeah, week. Yeah, I, I, I put a special request in for some flapjacks um, just to provide us some energy for if we're doing uh, Joe, Wicks. Joe Wicks exercise <laughs> on a, each morning. Yeah. Um, I'd reckon I, if you can do that, I'd do it. It's It really does yeah. invigorate you and make you feel good. Um, for and for anybody that day. thinks 30 minutes exercise is a bit much, if you're not generally very, very um, fit and active, he does do one which is aimed at older people, which is just 10 minutes. And it's. A, a I should be honest, is the one what we, <laughs> we should be we doing. We should be doing that one, not the one that our yeah. grandchildren are doing, who are yeah. young and fit yeah. and used to running yeah. about. But we're just wanting to do our best to, mm. to keep fit, aren't we? Yeah. Um, yeah. We don't have the benefit of having a big garden or anything. Um, yeah. So, yeah, but we're. Uh, we're doing okay. We're keeping we? going. I've started doing a, a jigsaw. Um, there'll be a picture there somewhere um, to, to show you. Yeah. Um, just to keep me occupied, me, me mind going. Yes. Um, and I, just doing odd jobs around the house. Um, Those jobs that you were always going oh, to do well, in your time. I, I, couldn't, I couldn't really do them because we were out all the time in the motorhome. Yes, home. you were. Yeah, we, we so were. now I've no excuse. You haven't, no. I've no excuse whatsoever. No, that, so. that lamp that's been broken in the bedroom for two years can now be fixed. Yeah, yeah. And I'm the boy, surprised and the they haven't thrown it away before can now. Be fixed and <laughs> this that, and other can be fixed. Uh, but I've got plenty of time to do that, um, so I'm not going to rush through them. I'm just going to take my time and save one a little, little bit, job a day. One job a day. Yeah, and then I should be done by the end of the week. <laughs> So yeah. I'll keep safe. I'll keep well. Yeah. yeah. Um, look after yourselves. Look after yourselves, and we uh, hope that um, we'll all be back out yeah. and about before too long. Yeah, and it'd be nice to see uh, what you're doing. I'm sure you'll be wanting to put a vlog up. Um, I know you can't do anything with your your motorhomes or go out or anything, but just update everybody and like us. Just let, let the uh, uh, the, the motorhome community uh, know what we're doing um, 
So, yeah, with that, we'll uh, we'll say goodbye and take care of yourselves. And we'll see you on the next vlog. See you soon. See you soon. Bye. Bye.